every precious person a happy new year and, and uh, all the best for the rest of the year. I'm sure many woke up with not such good news. Some were failing, some were fearful, some were just hopeless and helpless and yeah. had so much doubt about the coming year because there's been so much going on. But we we'll start work, the year off full of faith, right. full of hope Absolutely. and full of expectancy. Absolutely, you have to do that because if you keep on dwelling yeah. on the past and if you're dwelling on all the problems, you're going to be pulled down. That's what we so, say. Absolutely. Yes. So I just want to uh, read Psalm 56 verse 3. It says, yeah, when I am afraid, I will trust in you, in God whose word I praise. In God I trust, I will not be afraid. What can mortal man do to me? Yeah. So let me just tell you something. You know, whatever is in your heart that you might be uncertain of, trust the Lord. Amen. Have no fear. The only Amen. one that we should fear is the Lord when we sin. Otherwise, we don't need to fear man. We don't need to uh, fear of what they've um, threatened us with and, and, and um, things like that. Yeah. Perhaps you've been threatened this year or at the end of last year you were threatened. If you didn't pay your debt, you'd be locked up or whatever. <laughs> so just trust the Lord. Don't be afraid of man because I can do nothing to you. That's trust right. God's Amen. word. He is your shepherd. You shall not Amen. lack. Just know that God's got a good future ahead of you. Don't dwell on the past. Don't dwell on your shortcomings. Don't dwell on the lack because the enemy is so fond of putting um, uh, stuff in your life that he really wants to um, uh, really uh, make you feel despondent and despaired. Don't accept those feelings. Go to the Word of God that He is your shepherd. You shall not lack don't be afraid of man. The only one you should be afraid of is the Lord. And yet, trust the Lord with all your heart. Lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways, acknowledge Him and He will direct your paths. Yes, amen. So just know God's got a good 2022 for you. Yep. Shape all that old stuff that's weighing you down and that's making you depressed and hopeless and helpless. Shake and you wonder what's next. Nothing's next. The next thing that's going to happen to you is blessing of the Lord. Yeah. You know the word of God says the blessing of the Lord makes rich and he adds no sorrow to it. So read his word. Thank him that he's your provider. He's your healer. He's your deliverer. He's your peace. Amen. He's the lover of your soul. He watches over you. Yes. He, he puts his angels charge over you. And he's always looking out for something Amen. good to do in your life. So Amen. really trust and you know, him. You can't stay down in the dark. No, you can't. If you stay down in the doldrums, that's where you're going to stay. It pulls you down. And, and the further you go down in the pit, the harder it is to get that's out. That's right. You know, Joseph, when he was thrown in the pit, he kept looking up. Yeah, that's right, looking at the Lord. Yeah, looking for the, the, the hand of the Lord to yeah, help him out, amen. to lift him out of his um, um, mud and mire, to lift him out of the pits that he was in. Yeah. But you know, God's a good God and He's going to do that to you. He's going to do, do that for you. He's going to lift you out of the mud and the mire. And He's going to give you a new lease in life. So just trust Him. Amen. doesn't matter what man's thrown at you, what they've said about That's you. Right. Don't believe the lie of the enemy. Because the enemy wants to really tire he you does. out with a lot of rubbish. He does. Choose to join the yeah, and Yes, and listen to God's word and believe God's word. The joy of the Lord is your strength. That's right. Amen. 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 Praise yes. God. Hallelujah. So Jesus. we come to communion. Amen. Thank you, Father God. Thank, Thank you, Lord. Lord. And, Hallelujah, uh, Jesus. We ask the Lord, Lord, just bless this bread which represents the body of Jesus that was broken so that we would be healed, Lord, for our sakes. And we eat it in remembrance remembering the price was paid for our healing. Thank you, Father. And if you're sick today, remember he's healed you already. Right. You are healed in Jesus' name. Let's eat together. And then we take the cup, Jesus called this, the cup of the new covenant, the covenant of grace. You see, we can't be perfect. And if we lived under the law, if you break one law, you broke them, bro them all. And Jesus challenged them by saying you can even break the law by not the actual act, but by thinking about it 
or the wrong motive in your heart. So if, if you've ever looked at another person of the opposite sex and uh, you've lost it in your heart, you've already committed adultery as far as he's concerned. That's what the word says. And, uh, and he shed his blood for our forgiveness. And whilst we fear the Lord when we sin, we can be encouraged knowing that the price has been paid for our sin. So it's not what you do when you, it's not falling that's a problem, it's what you do when you've fallen. You need to get up, brush the dust off your feet, repent. In other words, walk in the opposite direction and start off afresh with the Lord. Lord. In Jesus' Thank name. So let's do it together. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Well, we pray daily for you, every person, and mm -hmm. those that have, yeah, no, 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 those that have um, sent messages and uh, written little notes what they trust in God for. I'm going, to, I'm going to do that one just now. Okay, we've already prayed over them, but we pray as many times as we can over your yeah. requests, and so expect God to come through for you. God will yet surprise you with His goodness. Amen. He will deliver you whatever you've trusted Amen. Him for. For the beginning of this year, expect it. It's going to happen suddenly. Yes. So get ready, family, friends, relatives. Yes. Beloved, get ready. God is going to surprise you with His goodness. So be expectant in Jesus' name. In amen. Jesus amen. Name. Amen, amen, and amen. Are you going to pray for the people of God? Father, yes, Lord. We bring every precious person before you, Father. We bring Keegan, we bring Deb, 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 Debbie before you, Father God. Amen. We bring every precious person before you, Father. We just thank you, Lord, that the, we curse cancer, we curse sickness, disease, Amen. bondage. We curse any form of drug uh, uh, usage. We curse it right now in Jesus' yes. name. We curse poverty, anxiety, and fear. It will not attach itself to you in any way, form, or shape in Jesus, right, name. in Jesus' name. The joy of the Lord is your strength. He is the strength of your life. So be encouraged that God has got your back. God is on your side. And He will deliver you. Amen. He will come through for you. Amen. Whatever you need, lay it at the foot of the cross and God will restore you. He'll heal, deliver, and surprise Amen. you in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. I don't mean to be rude when I tell you not to name them all. This book is full of names, <laughs> and if he was to name everybody in this book, we would be here till 10 o'clock tonight doing this one short video, <laughs> which would become a long video. And so I encourage you just to pray for the... Specifically, pray, yeah. Not, not for well, naming the people, That's right. because we've got so many people in the book. And if you've asked us to pray for us, your name With your needs, is in the book. You can Jesus expect name. God to come through for you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen, amen. But, so, God bless you. Just remember, start the year off as you mean to go. We've been, we fasted, and uh, we fast every year. We end it tomorrow, and uh, I just want to tell you now that uh, it's the first fruits that we are presenting to the Lord as in honor of Him and uh, as a sacrifice to Him as well. That's how we tend. We want to carry on for the rest of the year amen, in amen, Jesus' name. Amen. So believe that you receive. When you ask in the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. The Lord bless and keep you. Make yes. his face shine upon you. Be gracious to give you peace and bless you in Jesus' Amen. mighty name. Amen. Amen. So God bless you. Till the next time.